channel. This is Asia Aquiel and today I am going to be sharing my New Year's resolutions. Now I usually don't make New Year's resolutions. I don't know why. I usually just know myself and I usually don't commit to things. Um, I don't like to set myself up for failure but this year I felt a little different and I made a New Year's resolution and I really think that I'm going to commit to it. So let me share with you 10 things that are on my New Year's resolution list. So number one is to plan out your days, your weeks, your months. It's just to plan out your year, create a goal of where you want to be next year around this same time, what you want to have done, where you would like to be in life. Whenever you write things down and you plan things, you're more more of a chance for you to actually do those things. So definitely plan out my days by writing them down. Number two is something I've been doing for a long time. It's nothing new. Is save money. Even if you know it's hard to save money, save a little bit, save a lot, save what you can. Um, it's very important to have money to put towards things that make your life better, such as an apartment or your business or your relationships or experiences. So save money if you want to travel, things like that. Number three, this one is a major for me at least, is be uplifting. And when, when I say be uplifting, be up, up, well, be uplifting. I mean, listen to more positive podcasts, listen to more positive music, be the person that you want to attract, the law of attraction, you know, spread positivity. That's the main thing that I want to be able to do this year is just be a more positive person. Okay, number four, I think this one might be a little hard. Mm. We're going to try to do it though is go to bed earlier. I've been going to bed at like 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock, even close to 3 some nights. I've been having some insomnia. Not really. But I've just been wanting to stay up. I don't understand why. Probably because I have a new job and I get off really late, sometimes at midnight. So it's, sometimes it's hard for me to go to bed early. That's a goal. It's not a realistic goal because I do get off at midnight. But I'm going to try my best to go to sleep earlier and wake up a bit earlier as well. All right, number five is also really important is plan more trips. I feel like I've been wanting to travel and I haven't been doing that. So I think that I definitely want to plan a major trip and maybe even go by myself or go with a loved one, I don't know, family member or friend. But I really want to plan a trip and go somewhere beautiful. Or even if, if it's just a weekend getaway, plan more trips. And number six, this one I think I'm going to do as soon as possible maybe tomorrow but tomorrow's a holiday so i don't know if they're open <laughs> is join a gym create a gym membership so i feel like if i put my money into the gym then i will be more prone to go because i'm paying for this service i have to utilize it and i think that working out is a major benefit for your physical health but your mental health also which is very big for me i need those Est that estrogen and those you know all that positive endorphins i need those definitely all right number seven is become more organized this is something i've been working on recently i've been becoming a neater person if you like go back a few videos down you'll see that i have that i'm pretty messy like you see my room i have been a messy person but this year i want to Create a clean space for myself and keep a clean space for myself because you are created to enjoy your space, especially those of you that pay for your space. If you're paying for something, you need to keep it clean so you can enjoy it. And it's a proven fact that if your space is clean, your mental space is clean. So I really think become more organized, even on top of just being more clean is organizing everything, getting rid of some things, decluttering, things like that. So number eight is not, oh wait, hold on. <laughs> number eight is to pay attention to my relationships. When I say pay attention to my relationships, I mean 
not to let people into my life anymore that don't bring me joy and happiness to pay attention to the people that aren't really there for me and that are just there for a moment or there for the wrong reasons um, just to pay attention to the space that I'm creating within myself and to protect my heart you know yeah, and also my relationship with God I really want to pay attention to that this year and grow spiritually that is a major goal for me is to just continue to grow spiritually I just got a Bible for Christmas let me go ahead and show you Bible for Christmas thank you grandma um, and I'm really excited about it I just started reading it today even though I haven't read that much um, but you can journal in it as well and a little bookmark I really love it and I plan on really just reading that and growing spiritually this year that's a major goal finding a church home as well things like that and it is a not to settle so this one ties into a lot guys so this year I oh my gosh this is tying into number 10 let me just tell you what number 10 is so number 10 is to move I'm planning to move by summer at the latest summer at the latest meaning August or July or June I'm, I really want to move by June but yes when I say don't settle don't settle with my living space don't settle with where I want to move because I've been saying oh maybe I'll just move to this small town or maybe I'll just move to this small town no I don't want to settle for anything I don't want to settle for relationships I don't want to settle for love fake love between friends family anybody this year is just about growth mentally and I really hope that you all really execute that as well mentally because that's all you do every single year is grow every single year you're a little bit different hopefully a lot different but those are my 10 new year's resolutions thank you so much for watching this if you have some new year's resolutions i would love to hear them definitely leave those down below let me know what your new year's resolutions are and i will see you all next time please check out the description box i want to tell you guys a few things down there i'll see you guys next time love you bye bye oh that's next year okay but really see y'all next time bye